Hi baby, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Eileen and today I'm gonna be doing a self-care day. I have many videos on my channel about me cleaning my room and if you know one thing about me, I let my room get to the point. This is literally just one week worth of mess. Um, but I'm gonna show you what it's like because I went to the store yesterday and I bought a bunch of stuff. I mean, I should have done a haul but I forgot to. Plus, like, I've been editing, I did my nails yesterday, and I went to the gym, and so I have, like, everything everywhere right now. I went to go get this bag, and I'm filling it up with my trash that are here in my room, and so that's on the floor, but I also went to the store yesterday, so I have, like, some things, too, so if you want to see how I clean my room, I have other videos on my channel, but... This was the stuff I went to go buy from the store yesterday. This right here is actually um, not from the store. It is a foam roller for after I work out. So I was using that yesterday. Then I went to go um, buy this SD card for my camera. And just these other things. This, I ate them last night as I unpacked. I have my chonies on the floor. Crazy. And yeah this is my whole room it's not as bad as i usually let it get i'm not gonna lie i just ate some watermelon so i have to take that out but i'm doing like a self-care day today like a complete saturday reset because sunday is sunday and i think on sunday i don't want to do anything um i am gonna try to like wake up early tomorrow but I always feel like Sunday's my day to like chill. So let's see. It's kind of crazy though, because I feel like I'm not doing anything with my life right now. I'm literally just being me. Anyway, so what I'm gonna do is I'm oiling my hair up right now with this oil. It's a hope and repair. I don't think it's actually gonna work, honestly. I just know it's gonna make my hair like shiny for the time being. Then I'm gonna put it in a braid. And then I'm gonna wash it. Probably. I'm not gonna wash it tonight, but I am gonna uh, like leave it in this hair oil for the next couple days. And then I'm going to go to the gym on Monday, so I'll be able to wash it out on Monday. But for today, I just really want to make sure I'm, like, take care of, taking care of everything. I'm going to take a bath. I really want to, like, exfoliate and do everything, like, to clean. And I don't know if this is bad. Oh! <laughs> I don't know if this is bad, but um, I've been massaging my head with a massage gun. And literally because like, I used to feel super like tense right here, like my temples. But then I started using the massage gun and I do still feel a little bit here. So I'll probably still need to use it. But I would use like the massage gun and it kind of like made all the pain go away. So I started using the massage gun right here on the crown of my head. And another thing is because like I heard that massaging your scalp will make your hair grow faster. I don't know if this is what they meant, like massaging it with the massage gun. It's probably not what they meant. But I'm doing it because I feel like it's gonna actually get the blood actually get the blood flowing. Cause I feel like my head is really like I don't know how to explain it it just feels like you know how like after you work out and it's felt like this for two years because hold on let me get I'm looking for a hair tie so hold on let me get a hair tie oh no I have one here but I'm gonna get another one too last year around this time like October ish I bought a massage gun and or September ish actually I bought a massage gun and I was just using that massage gun to like you know massage 
like whatever and like my legs or whatever but then I started you know realizing like my head was in so much pain at one point like it was just really really bad so I just started using the massage gun but I kind of stopped using it at the beginning of this year because like I just 2024 I kind of stopped using it because I just realized like I was getting busy and honestly it was like so much work but now that I'm not busy anymore and like I'm literally just living day to day I'm just more so trying to like get all that stress out of my head because it feels so sore like you can literally just put your hand on it like this and it hurts like I don't know how to explain it like other than after you work out and you know how like your legs or your arms like how that feels like it's all sore that's what it feels like and I'm just like oh my gosh I've done everything like I've gotten to like professionals to get that like you know massage looked at and honestly it's nothing just tension like everyone says like oh it's just tension and I feel like it's tension from like stress of living on my own and like it's just built up tension honestly so I feel like um, I feel like it'll be gone in a couple months or so. It's just, like, I had to deal with that. And I, I didn't, like, frequently massage it. Like I said before, it was mostly my temples that were bothering me. So I mostly focus on the temples. But now the, like, my temples do, like, kind of bother me right here, like, still. But I think, like, that has to do a lot with my jaw. And, um... I'm just gonna keep focusing on my on the crown of my head until it like gets better. But you wanna know something? I cut my hair to the point where like it's so uneven. Like I have little pieces of like wait hold on. You can't really see. But I have little pieces in my hair. So now whenever I do a braid, it's like it's so uneven. But it's fine because I'm working on it. I've just finished cleaning my room, and I know it doesn't look like it, but, okay, here's the catch. I have to file my taxes, and I just went through the receipts, and I have, like, my notepad right there, and I basically write all my expenses for the year, and I left those blankets there because I'm watching, like, TV with the freaking nasties. So, now that my room is clean, and I do still have to file taxes, but, like I said, I'm watching TV with the freaking nasties, so I just file the taxes while I'm doing, um, watching TV with them, just because it's, like, kind of, like, something, you know, like, multitasking. Anyway, I'm about to shower, and after the shower, we'll see what's up with that. And then, I have these basket of candles. So since I just got home from the gym, we're gonna set these up. And we're going to be live with the Freaky Nasty. See, that's them. Now that we've lit all the candles, we're going to add Epsom salt into this bag because it was like falling. So, we're going to add some Epsom salt. To add the Epsom salt, we just need to do like a scoop. And this is from Muscles. I was gonna do a bubble bath, but I need to wash my hair. Okay, one more scoop. Now, I'm just going to tell you what I got because I just want to show you. I got this Moroccan sleeve and basically it works to exfoliate so you just sit in the tub for like 10 to 2 minutes with this beam and then you use this and then it's perfect to take off all that nasty sweat. Yeah. So I'm gonna get into here. This is the dead skin that is coming off the glove. We just do it to the other side. Watch 
just go wipe off the water and then scrub and do you see the mugre all that stuff the lodo that's coming off my skin sorry my camera's getting foggy I'm telling you. And does it hurt? No. It'll be in my um, bio down below so you can get this for yourself because truly it's disgusting. Since I finished taking my bath, I'm letting the water drain and then I'm going to do a cold rinse so that my skin cells can shrink and my hair too. Oh my gosh, look at my dead skin. Look at my dead skin. Oh. Yes, I have to file my taxes, but I just made this little bed for myself. And I have a blanket there and a blanket there. And so I'm going to cover myself and me and the Freaky Nasties are going to watch this show. We literally watched like <laughs> the entire two seasons in three days and the first day was because we started it late at night so we were like getting tired but we watched like six seven or eight episodes in one single night and now we're on season two episode 13 today and there they are but i usually put them right here with my little tripod thing and they sit there and we watch movies together